at Jack Peterson's camp where he's training for his championship fight with Ben Ford. He looks as though he's having a good time, but he's in deadly earnest. This work on the light bag sharpens up his timing. And then he goes into the ring and has some sparring with his partners wearing those ear guards. No use getting a cauliflower ear when you're not getting paid for it. And now, Jack, have you got something to say? I am feeling very fit and looking forward to my fight with Ben Ford. I'm sure it'll be a good contest and may the best man win. That's the stuff. And here is Ben Ford. Leapfrog is part of his training diet. And there's some work on the heavy bag. And it's rumored that Ben Ford has developed a terrific right-hand punch. We'll see when the big fight comes on. There he is practicing that right-hand punch and a way of tightening up his stomach muscles, getting in shape for the London bus rush at 5 o'clock. And there's another way of tightening up the stomach muscles, and you can do this in your own living room. Now he's sparring in the ring with his partner, Eddie McGuire, taking some punishment about the body, hardening himself up for his contest. Isn't he a fine-looking chap? Ben Ford, the South African. And now the night of the big fight, Jack Peterson wearing his famous green dressing gown. Peterson! What a roar of applause he's getting from the Welsh contingent. And now for Ben Ford. On my right, Ben Ford! His fiancée is sitting just below him, dressed in white. What a beautiful picture she is. Now they're sparring. There's the first round, and they've come out into the center of the ring. Peterson tries to shoot out his left hand, but Ford ties him up in the center. Peterson lashes out with that left again, but Ford rolled the punch nicely and came back with his left. And Peterson's crouching low, waiting to bring in that left hand. They're measuring each other up. Peterson shoots in that rapier left of his, and it lands this time. Once again, that left comes over, but Ford backs away nicely and times it. He brings over a terrific right hand cross, which misses. Peterson backs him into the corner. Now they're sparring there, and Ford shoots out a left. And that's the end of the round. They're coming up to the third round now. Ford is determined. You can see it in his eyes as he rushes back Peterson back to the rope. And Peterson stung into action and drives Ford back. But Ford is relentless and he brings over that right hand. And there's Peterson against the ropes and Peterson goes down for the count. There he is taking the count and he comes up at seven. And Ford is relentless now. Ford senses victory and he drives Peterson back to the ropes. Peterson staggering and once again Peterson hits the canvas. But Ford comes in after him. Jack Peterson is almost helpless against the ropes. He's just covering up, barely hanging on. Ford comes in close. Peterson ties him up. Ford tries to bring those hands down so he can bring over the finishing punch. He's trying to block those hands off. Peterson's covering up. Ford tries to brush those hands away. The referee tries to break them. There's Ford getting ready. He's measuring them. And there's the puncher, right hand to the jaw. Poor Jack Peterson is practically helpless, but he's dancing away gamely. Once again, that terrific right hand, the punch developed in secret, comes over. It's the sort of punch with which Snelling beat Lewis. Once again, Ford is ready to bring it over, and he rocks Peterson onto his heels with another terrific smash to the jaw. Lefts and right now, to the jaw and to the body. Left to the body and right to the head. Peterson's hanging on for dear life. He sees the championship slipping away from him, the championship he's held since 1932. He's badly cut up. The referee steps between them, breaks that clinch, and Ford tears in again. More rights and lefts to Peterson's head, and he practically pulls Peterson to the canvas. The referee steps in between them and stops the fight. The referee has stopped the fight. Ben Ford wins the heavyweight championship of Great Britain and the British Empire. Listen to the applause he's getting. Ben Ford. Well, I'm very glad that I'm the first South African to win the British and Empire title. I wish to thank the British public for the jolly fine sportsmanship like manner in which they've taken it. Thank you very much. I too am very proud of you, Ben.